folks, yeah, here I am again. Uh, today, I'm going to share to you the step-by-step uh, -step process on how I'm able to get my appointment uh, to this immigration in regards to my application for my visa. I know that this time around during this MCO 3.0 is very tough for us to get an appointment. And yeah, uh, this is also one of the reasons why I created this video content in order to share with you guys how did I did it. I also received some private messages coming from my personal page from friends out there saying that, hey, how did you get this? How did you get your appointment? And so on and so forth. So, yeah, this is the factor why I, I came up to this uh, video uh, tutorial or how to say this video material in order to share with you my experience. And I hope you can find it useful. So without further ado, this is how I did it. Okay, uh, I went to the website. Uh, the name of the website is sto.my.imi.gov.my slash e dash timujanji slash home dot php okay this is the name of the website for the immigration and then it prompted me to this interface and i selected the continue slash proceed tab in blue color then it prompted me to key in my details uh, required to my application so just fill in the details especially your location like your state and your desired application then I just click all the date or uh, the date slots uh, available so I just click next 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 so whatever it is because it's really hard for me to get the appointment I will tell you I took me about I think 10 times you know but still nothing happens it's still all the slot is full so what I did was uh, as what I did last year uh, I visited the website in different browser. So what actually these browser are? These browsers can be Mozilla Firefox, uh, uh, Chrome, Opera, Vivaldi, Microsoft Edge, and Ice Dragon, those kind of things, okay? But what I did was I woke up early in the morning around 2 to yeah, around 2 a.m. and then I visited the website in this different browser and I'll tell you what. I'm so lucky that I'm able to get the appointment, okay, using Mozilla Firefox. So that's what I did. So after getting my appointment, what I did next is I need to confirm my appointment, I mean my immigration appointment. This is very important. Once you got already your appointment, you have to go back again to the website and confirm your appointment. You have to do that. So this is how I did it. First is that I went back to the site which is uh, sto.imi.gov.my slash e dash timujanji slash home.php using any browser. So this time around, I didn't use uh, uh, Mozilla Firefox. Instead, I used Chrome, okay? Then, uh, it, after that, it prompted me to, uh, to select for the next tab which is uh, I selected the confirm slash cancel appointment tab that is in color green then uh, from here you have to select the email in the field then enter your email address you have uh, used when you submitted your application so remember the email that you have sent during the application is the one that you need to key in here yeah then uh, select, uh, select the search button then your details will be automatically shown below like what uh, you can see in my screen guys for privacy reasons i block some of the contents here but for as long as to show you how the the process i think it should be good enough once your details is correct you have to select the confirm button to confirm your attendance for your appointment date and time upon confirmation you are again required to fill in the info as uh, below so this one is like your name your passport etc and just click the yes button then after clicking the yes button a pop-up message will appear like this so you just select the ok button then it will be followed by another confirmation note so you press ok okay after finishing the product you confirm already right after confirming and everything all you have to do is to go back again to the site and print it okay so the print material is the one that you will use to show when you have when you visit the immigration office so what I did was I went back to the site using the same browser, actually the same browser lights, uh, Chrome. Then I selected the check print application tab that is in light uh, blue color, okay? Then from there, uh, I keyed in the category field as email again. 
and then I entered my email address and my details are shown below. That's how simple it is, okay? So I selected the Chatak slash print tab. and uh, save the file into PDF so it's easy for me to print, yeah? So that's it, folks. Please remember that once you get your appointment date and time, you need to go back again to the website and you have to confirm your appointment. And this is very important, yeah? So that you will not be missed out. And as a tip, uh, as a tip, actually, you can also do your, uh, you, can, you can also book your appointment using your phone. Because I can see that the, the website is also mobile friendly, so I think there should be no problem. I know the slot is very hard to get, but just select whatever slot that you have. Uh, so that's it, folks. I hope uh, you can also help to give a like to this post if you find it uh, useful to you. So thank you so much, guys. And please, please, please stay safe as always. And I hope to see you again on my next video uploads. Bye for now, guys. Thank you.